Seventh and eighth grade math students at Elk Ridge Middle School in South Jordan spent their last day of school solving Rubik's Cubes, all to make some mosaics. Fox 13's Lauren Steinbrecher shows us how their math skills, combined with some teamwork, turned into something positively Utah. A piece of paper put on plastic lunch trays. They don't know what it looks like. Is a small part of a bigger picture. Are we just going? Yeah. yeah, you just go. It's a map of sorts as these kids twist their way toward the final product. Seventh and eighth grade math students at Elkridge Middle School in South Jordan are working together. Which one are you doing right now? I, I just did it, Piecing together Rubik's Cube portraits. The students don't even know yet what they're making. For now, it's all about which color goes where. Last week, we taught all the students in seventh and eighth grade how to solve a Rubik's Cube. We take some of the principles that they learned while they were solving the cube, the whole thing, and then we say, hey, you just need to solve one face. We focus on, you know, the, the making the cross, and then we make the edge pieces, and you'll see kids start to get it. Once the kids get the program and everything and they understand what they need to do, they just dive in. It was super intense. Moving quickly in a race against the clock. I can tell you that putting this together this quickly was one of the most amazing experiences I've had as a teacher. They reveal the big picture in only 15 minutes, and it's someone you might recognize. I feel great. It makes me feel accomplished because I've done this huge picture with many of my friends and I love the jazz, so it's pretty cool. In all, the kids used 420 Rubik's Cubes to make what we must say is an impressive mosaic of Utah jazz guard Donovan Mitchell. I think the value of it is they love knowing how to do something that ha that's hard. I think every person loves that. And if they can get done with this, we can teach them how to do it in a period or a week or whatever it takes if they'll stick with it. And then they get a huge sense of accomplishment when they're done with that. Lauren Steinbrecher, Fox 13 News, Utah. Oh, I love it so much. Congratulations to all those kids. And there's more. The students also made mosaics of Rudy Gobert and every administrator at Elk Ridge Middle School. They look so good. The teachers say they hope to get more Rubik's Cubes to make even bigger mosaics in the future.